is Salifia and I am coming in at you with another video. So let me just tell you ladies before I get started with this video, I would just like to say God is good all the time. All the time. Yes, he is. Um <laughs> Y'all, I am in a such a great headspace right now. I am in such a great place right now. I am living my life and I am good, you know? <laughs> so for some reason, I feel like this camera is wopsided. But anyway, I am good. I am good. I don't know. I just, you know how you just, I'm just foot free, fit, fit, fancy free, foot loose, whatever you want to say. I mean, I cannot express that to you all enough. I am in a good place right now. I really am. I, you know, you all know I went through my, I, I, I didn't show it on camera because, you know, but, you know, I went through it. I, as they would say, I went down through there. <laughs> but I'm good now. I am. I am good now. I'm, like I said, I am in a good headspace. I am, I'm, I don't know. I don't know what to say. I just know that prayer works. Prayer works. If anybody tells you it does not, then they don't know. They don't know about praying. So I'm telling you, prayer works. You know, you can, when, when you're going through something, and I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I just got to get this little testimony, but when you're going through something, no matter who it's with, because believe you me, you all, I went through not just losing my relationship, I have went through things with my daughter, and I just don't get on here and share that, but I have let go and let God, let go of that stuff, even with my daughter, with the things, I mean, she's 13, and y'all already know how this generation of children are and she is no different from the rest of these children out here and I'm trying to get her to not be like the rest of the children so to speak but you know at the end of the day a mother a parent can only do so much and I'm not gonna say you know it's like I'm just like psh, 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 wipe my hands with my daughter because I can never do that that's my child I love her she's my only child but I am going to have to let her Fall on her, and I would rather let her fall on her face at 13 than wait until she's 20, 21, 22, and fall on her face. So I can't keep fixing things for her. I can't keep trying to make things um, easy breezy, as I guess you could say. So that being said, y'all already know it's, it's 7:23. It's our y'all already know it's easy, it's late. I'm gonna try to try to try try. I say that all the time, but you know, I mean, my evenings and days. Even though I get off, and then my aunt, I had to have my aunt live today. My mom, and y'all know my mom, my dad, my my step my stepfather, my dad. He he's his health it, with the early onset dementia. My aunt and her diabetes, and she had a uh, toe cut off last year, and she's about to have to get another one cut off. And it's just it's 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 hard. It's a lot, and you know she she's on dialysis and everything so all I can say is please just if you're a praying person pray for her um whatever it is if it's in God's will it will be whatever it is I just you know I, I tell her I just I just told her today because she's been having some problems with her hand the hand that her uh, stent or whatever that thing is for dialysis is in and and I had to just tell her today you know whatever they got to do to it auntie let them do that I would rather if they had to cut off your hand I'd rather them cut off your hand and you walk around with one hand then for you not to be here so I love my aunt dearly this is my mom's twin sister I love my aunt dearly I love my mom dearly I love you know I, I just want them to be okay and you all you know my mom she's had issues where she's been back and forth back and forth into the hospital I just wasn't coming on here telling you all about it uh, because it, it's just you know I'd rather come on here and, and bring bring the good stuff than bring old sad sap stuff. But you know, I, I've just and me and my mom we talk all the time and stuff and you know and God knows my mom, my mom my aunt they'll be sixty in June and I hope that both of them see that and many 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 more. 
but you know my mom she always says let's just face the fact that my health and you know your aunt's health is not the best and you know I just want you to be strong da 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 da, da. and so that being said you know I, I don't think I never told y'all a few years ago because my mom did not have insurance on stuff I took out insurance on my mom so I do have insurance on my mom that I pay for every month because I was not I will not set up a GoFundMe account to bury my mom if something happens to her. I will not go set up. I don't have it on my aunt, but my aunt has some herself. I will not go set up a GoFundMe account to bury my aunt. So, you know, I, I, I just, no. So, that being said, you know, take care of yourself. Take care of your loved ones. People, my aunt, one of her things when she was younger, she was scared to go to the doctor and stuff. And I think that, and you can't go back and say the shoulda, woulda, coulda, but I think that she would be a whole lot better now had she went to the doctor when she was younger and taking care of things. And I used to always tell her, auntie, go to the doctor, go to the doctor, go to the doctor. And she just did not want to go and she didn't go. And, you know, unfortunately, her health is not the best. But anyway, she's keeping on pushing. And I got to go over there in a few minutes when I get to make this video to take her some. I'm just taking about five minutes talking. So anyway, um, I, I'm, I'm coming in with a haul. And some of this stuff I bought uh, almost a month and a half ago. I think something, no, I didn't buy anything about two months ago, but about a month and a half ago, whatever. And so I've been just, I don't know, just been busy, tired, and haven't hauled it. But now I'm going to haul it. So let's start off with one of the first things that I did get, which is, and y'all know what, I'm going to tell y'all, I'm going to be truthfully honest. I really, really, really thought that I was going to be an income tax. Baller! No, I'm just joking. But you know how they call those people, those income tax ballers, those people that go out there, get the income tax, and they think they're balling for a week, a month, or whatever the case may be. I thought I was going to be one of those, but unfortunately, I'm not. Um, I'm still waiting to get my notification. I am being audited. So, yeah. I don't know when I get my taxes. But, at any rate. So, that being said, uh, fortunately, Things are, I'm not going to say like, let me see how to put it. I have a little help. Wow. <laughs> I was able to get me some things, some treats and some trinkets and some things that I wanted. And one of the things, and this was not planned, this, this purchase was not planned. I went into Dillard's to go to the Mac counter. And that, yeah, I'll show you that in a minute. But this right here, I'm walking through Dillard's and the lady stops me and convinces me to buy this dang on perfume set. This is the Bella Vince Commuto perfume set. Now I've never had anything from him. This is my first set and inside the set and I've already taken So inside the set this I've used this a few times. This is a little tra travel bottle that goes here and went here. So I took this out and I've been using this but Inside here is this perfume, this Vince Commuto perfume, and this bag. It's a makeup bag, and I thought it was so, so, so cute. And, you know, I was choosing between this one and another one, and this bag is, like I said, it is just uber awesome cute. I really, really like it. And I think I'm going to switch this one out with my other makeup bag. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm gonna switch this one out with my other makeup. All right, and here's the bottle. Now this perfume, I'm gonna be truthfully honest, I think this set was like $89. So it was not cheap and I normally, and it smells so good, so, so, so good. And it, it, it lasts a while. Um, I don't smell it and that's a good thing. I want someone, uh, an old person, an older person once told me that if you can smell your perfume, then your perfume is not meant for you. Um, other people should smell your perfume, not you. So if I can smell my perfume all day, I will not wear it anymore because then that lets me know that it's not. Okay, I've been talking about needing a new lens. I'm about to definitely need one because I just dropped my camera. Battery went dead. I had to change it. I dropped the camera. Oh my God, it's all my good. It's all my good. It's like shit. Okay, the other item I was actually in Dillard's to get is a MAC Studio Fix Powder. And this one I purchased in the color NC42. And the reason why I purchased this was because I was setting my makeup with uh, my other, my concealer with my NC43. 
and that was just making it was a little bit too dark if you all know about MAC makeup MAC makeup oxidizes a lot so that was oxidizing too much so now I'm using this but this is not the only thing I'm using to set my concealer and I will have an updated uh, I guess you could say an updated routine soon because I'm gonna get back into doing some things with makeup now I purchased this and I'm not exactly sure when it was but it was from Sephora but it was not during the VIB sale it was before the VIB sale but I decided to purchase the Laura Mercier loose setting powder and what made me purchase this was watching someone's video I think her name is uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Shayla or something I'll, I'll find it and, and I think it's Shayla but it's the Laurie Laura Mercier loose pattern I don't remember how much this cost but it is a one ounce size and it has been awesome I have been looking for something for a long time to set my under eye concealer something that I would be happy with something that I would like and I finally found something this will definitely stay in rotation in my makeup so stand when I do set my concealer I'm actually using both of these to set my concealer and yeah I'll like I said I'll have a video up soon to show you how I'm doing that okay this item right here and this one is Sharnice's fault I just got this a couple of days ago with my Sephora VIB items and yeah I was not planning on purchasing anything from makeup forever but thanks to Sharnice I did and girl I am so happy that I did uh, today was my second day using this and I'm so far since yesterday and today I'm very happy with using this powder and the color that I did get is number 173 it's the color that Sharnice uses and so I got the same color we're not exactly the same tone but we're right there you know together with complexion so I got this in the color 173 all right so something i got this was probably about two months ago i was looking on i got an email from somewhere i don't remember because i think it was because i'm a member of hot look but i got an email about nordstrom rack and i ended up purchasing this lorac the getaway palette i ended up purchasing this palette for 20 dollars that included shipping and everything it's called the getaway eye and cheek palette now I have not used this palette and I am definitely looking forward to putting it into my rotation but here are the colors of this palette I think these colors are uber uber awesome beautiful gorgeous and I'm not because this video is going to be long already I am not going to do swatches um, this color they don't have colors on here and they're not even on the sheet so but that's okay but the color I just swatched right here is this one right here so of course you can look and see this is the highlighter this would be the bronzer this would be the blush so this is basically a full face in one palette so you all know that when I go on my trips to Atlanta or something, unless I have a specific color that is not in here, this palette will be traveling with me. Some other items that I got from Macy's. And I may have gotten a Laura Mercier from Macy's. I'm not even sure. But anyway, something else I got, I purchased the Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel. If you have oily skin, I am telling you. Now, this bottle cost me $35, but, you know, it, it, it is what it is. It's okay. Because um, it'll last a long time because I'm still using samples that I got when I went to Las Vegas. I just started using them about maybe a month and a half ago, but I'm still using them. So, this right here should last me a pretty good while. 